Hi, if you have epilepsy, then you should be worried about the effects of alcohol on your brain and on your seizures. Today I will discuss if you can drink alcohol if you have epilepsy and if alcohol can worsen your seizures. Okay, if you did not close this video, that means that you did not get mad at me and you are interested in learning the truth about alcohol and epilepsy. Thank you for that and let's discuss this in details and I have good news and bad news for you. Let's discuss some facts first. The first thing is that alcohol by itself can lower the seizure thresholds, which means it can make seizures happen much easier, especially if it was drinking consumed more than three uh, volumes of alcohol or worse, which is binge drinking and drinking too much, which can lead into worsening of seizures and status epilepticus, which is long-standing seizures that can be fatal in some cases and needs hospitalization and ICU care. The second thing is that alcohol gets metabolized in the liver and the same place where the anti-seizure medications gets metabolized and processed, which can lead to interaction between alcohol and anti-seizure medications. And it can affect the levels of anti-seizure medications, which can lead to seizures. And the anti-seizure medications make the alcohol be more effective if you would or affect the body more and you can get uh, having symptoms from alcohol much easier if you're on anti-seizure medications. The third thing is that if you stop alcohol suddenly that can lead to alcohol withdrawal seizures and those can happen usually between six hours and 72 hours from the last drink if you were drinking habitually and regularly and that can also lead to severe withdrawal symptoms called delirium tremens or DTs that also needs hospitalization and ICUC and in some cases it can be fatal. It is important to realize that alcohol withdrawal seizures by themselves are not considered epilepsy and people who do not have epilepsy if they can have multiple alcohol withdrawal seizures that does not lead to epilepsy. However, if it is repeated for long term the excitation of the brain can trigger the brain to have spontaneous seizures and epilepsy in the future even without having alcohol mixed in. And it is important to know that alcohol is highly addictive and people with epilepsy often have depression and anxiety and they can self-medicate themselves with alcohol which eventually makes everything worse. Can I drink alcohol if I have epilepsy? Well after all of what we discussed here is what is the recommendation with after the studies. So you can drink alcohol socially in a very small amount far in between, that can be okay in people with epilepsy, but you should know yourself if that small amount of alcohol can trigger your seizures or not. My advice to my patients is that you should abstain completely from alcohol and label yourself as I do not drink, which makes it easier on you so that you do not have the drinks that can lead to more drinks and sometimes you know there's a party or Super Bowl night that you get the first drink and second drink and be before you know it you're drinking too much and that can lead to seizures. I have a patient who is so sensitive to alcohol even if his wife puts wine taste on the cake even after baking it he will eat and he will have a seizure because of that. What can I do if I have alcohol abuse history and epilepsy? Well here is the good news that we have anti-seizure medications that work great for seizures and epilepsy and at the same time they can treat alcohol abuse and decrease the craving for alcohol and also decreases the withdrawal symptoms if they happen and they worked great for my own patients in many times. Those medications are zonisamide and topiramate or Topamax. Those medications are very helpful in alcohol but some of the side effects you should know that they can decrease the appetite and cause weight loss. And we know that people who are having alcohol abuse history, they usually have malnourishment and they have loss of weight already. So it is important to discuss with your doctor if those medications are a good choice for you. And we should know that alcohol abuse is a medical condition that needs medical attention and it is very difficult to stop on your own. And we know that epilepsy by itself has much, much higher chances of having having anxiety and depression and psychiatric symptoms and there is a specific treatment for those conditions with epilepsy that I discuss in detail in this video that you can review and stay healthy and see you in the next one. Salam.